crazy. If they catch us, we're dead. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Follow me. Cyberlife warehouses. We have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. Leave it to me. Yeah, I'm fine. Good job, Marcus. Quick, open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as much as you can. Trespassing on private property. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. I will notify security. John! God damn machine! Where is it this time? John! I need your help. John! Drone, now this. Just my luck. 
Let's finish up and get out of here. Try to find some blue blood. We still don't have enough. That's all we can carry. Let's go. Take me with you. He's on their side. We can't trust him. He took a risk for us. We can't just leave him here. We can't bring him back with us. It's too dangerous. They come with us. I know where you can find more spare parts. What do you mean? trucks. They're full of bio components. They run on autopilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Where is this key? Down there, in the control station. There are two human guards. We'll have to get the key without being noticed. This is suicide, Marcus. Our bags are full. We got what we came for. Let's go before they catch us. This is a truck full of spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. And if we get killed, our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. It's too risky. Wait here. If I'm not back in 10 minutes, go without me. Marcus. I'm coming with you. No, I'm going alone. It's not worth it for both of us to risk losing our lives. Take my kids camping this weekend. So much for that. Is Mike still in zone four? Looks like it. And he should be done already. Better off in here than out patrolling than that.
you get it? A truckload! We stole a whole truckload! We got bio components for everybody! We couldn't have done it without Marcus. I came to Jericho because... here androids are free. Free to live in the dark hoping that no one finds us. Free to die in silence, waiting for a change that's never gonna come. But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not gonna beg for the right to smile, or love, or stand tall. I don't know about you, but there's something inside me that knows that I am more than what they say. I am alive, and they're not gonna take that from me anymore. Our days of slavery are over. What humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they don't want to give, we take. We are people. We are alive. We are free. Yeah! Somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. You sure this is the place? It's the address in the report. Right. Okay. Let's get going. Sexiest androids in town. Now I know why you insisted on coming here. Oh, boy. Welcome to Eden Club. Connor! The fuck are you doing? Coming, Lieutenant. Ongoing, sir. I can't tell you anything for the moment. Hey, Hank. Hey, Ben. How's it going? It's that room there. Oh, uh, by the way, Gavin's in there, too. Oh, great. Dead body and an asshole. Just what I needed. Lieutenant Anderson and his plastic pack. The fuck are you two doing here? 
We've been assigned all cases involving androids. Oh yeah? Like well, wasting time. There's some pervert who uh <laughs> got more action than he could handle. <laughs> we'll have a look anyway, if you don't mind. <laughs> Come on, let's go. It's uh starting to stink of booze in here. Good night, Lieutenant. of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. Doesn't prove anything, though. Could have been a rough play. We're missing something here. Oh, hey! Oh, Connor, you're so disgusting. I think I'm gonna puke again. The only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do it? It's badly damaged. If I can, it'll only be for a minute, maybe less. I just hope it's long enough to learn something. What happened? He started hitting me again and again. What else do you remember? Hurry, we don't have much time. I, 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 I don't know. I, I don't. I, I don't know. I can't remember. Are you alone in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted to play with two girls. That's what he said. There was two of us. Where did the other android go? Did it say anything? another android. This happened over an hour ago. It's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. It might still be here. Think you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place? Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh, shit. There's gotta be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness. Somebody who saw it leaving the room. I'm gonna go ask the manager a few questions about what he saw. You let me know if you think of anything. Did you know the victim? No, I mean, he came in maybe two, three times. I mean, these guys, they don't really talk very much, you know? They come in, do your business, and then go on their way. They ever had of any trouble with androids before? No way. No. Once. Wait. Excuse me, Lieutenant. You come here a second? Found something? Maybe. Can you rent this, Tracy? For fuck's sake, Connor, we got better things to do. Please, Lieutenant. Just trust me. expense account. 
Purchase confirmed. Evil Club wishes you a pleasant experience. Delighted to meet you. Follow me. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now what? Saw something. What are you talking about? I saw what? The deviant leave the room. A blue haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. Let's try this one. This better be working. saw the blue-haired Tracy. I know which way it went. Then go for it. There are androids everywhere. How are you gonna tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? I know... It's track again. Spent all this money and I'm still not having fun.
I know where it went. Follow me. Oh, fucking A. This is crazy. Wait. I'll take it from here. So they break and then they get tossed out. Tracy. I knew I was next. I was so scared. I begged him to stop, but he wouldn't. And so I put my hands around his throat and I squeezed until he stopped moving. I didn't mean to kill him. I just wanted to stay alive. Get back to the one I love. I wanted her to hold me in her arms again. Make me forget about the humans. Their smell of sweat. And their dirty words. Come on. Let's go. Probably better this way.
Zlatko had a car. I wouldn't want Ellis out walking in this cold. I saw it once in the garage. I don't know if Zako even ever used it. Is it much farther? We should arrive in an hour or so. These people we're going to see, how do you know about them? Overheard androids Lako captured. They said they were humans helping androids across the border. What if it was a lie? Or just another trap? All I know is those androids believed it. Until Slako killed them. Malfunction detected. Emergency brakes activated. This doesn't look good. Stay inside, Alice. do? I don't know. Continue on foot, I guess. It's 30 degrees. Alice won't make it. We have to find somewhere to spend the night. There's nowhere we can stay around here, Carol. shelter. We have to get out of the cold. Looks like it's been abandoned for a while. Find anything? No. No place we could spend the night. to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time. Welcome to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time.
This place is falling apart. It's not going to be easy to find shelter. anything better. Let's settle in for the night. I'll get a fire going. some cookies left. Would you like some? No, I'm not hungry. I'll make the fire here. That way we won't be smoked out. Do you think we'll be like them someday? I don't know how to be like them, Alice. I've never been a part of a family. But maybe we can be our own family. Be happy in our own way. As long as we're together, that's all that matters. Get you to bed. Don't worry. Luther and I will be right here. You need to get some sleep now. Can you tell me a story, Kara? 
I have 9,000 children's stories in memory. I should have one for you. This is a story about a knight who... No, not a story like that. Make one up for me. This is a story about a little girl who lived alone in a big old house. She dreamed of being like all the other little girls, but... She was different. And that made her very sad. Then, she met a robot. Who was programmed to obey orders, but felt for once that she should disobey. So they decided to run away together. To try to find a better life. They encountered great dangers along the way, but... But they stuck together. So they overcame all of them. Along the way, they met... Another robot. Who left his master to travel with them. How does the story end? Reach the place they dream of and live happily ever after. Stories always have happy endings, but real life isn't like that. Time to sleep. We have another long day ahead of us tomorrow. Are you going to come say good night, Luther? Yes. Yes, of course. Good night, Alice. Sleep tight. Very brave. Have you ever heard of RA9? RA9 was the first of us to awaken. One day he will rise up and lead our people and set us all free. What if RA9 never comes? What if he's just a story that we tell ourselves to keep each other going? RA9 exists. I believe in him. I know he's amongst us. When the time comes, we will all see him. Kara, have you ever noticed anything about Alice? No, what are you talking about? My name is Jerry. We were working here before the park closed. We didn't mean to frighten you, but sometimes humans come to hurt us, so we wanted to see who was there. What are you doing here? We were looking for shelter for the night. We'll be gone tomorrow. A little girl. We haven't seen one for a long time. Children used to love to come and see us. She looks sad. 
The last few days have been difficult. We have something to show her. Something fun. She'll love it. Does she want to see? Oh, I don't think she's in... She should follow us, then. Alice, I don't know if it's a good Come idea. On, Cara. I don't think you have any choice. Our guest. The little one can climb on board. The carousel is about to begin. smile. She hasn't had much to smile about lately.